no one here is fighting me for it, so I may as well just be the leader. I'm, I'm new. I don't know what I'm doing. <laughs> Playing that just to uh, act innocent, act humble, act like he doesn't know what he's doing, so that the rest of us put our guards down. So this is the night that I put my skills up. Ooh. There we go. Wow, thank you. Because I stuck out for like two years straight with no, they had no idea. And then me too. I thought it was clear that they were not good decision makers. I don't know. I wonder does he have like a super ninja like strategy or something like that? Then, for example, I voted for him, nominated him to be the leader, but I'm actually having second thoughts. I was not surprised to learn I was in the power player group because I have been in the highest ranked group every night. Oh, okay, so Mana from last night. Wow, did not expect that one. I, I didn't either. <laughs> Look, me either. Something is wow. fit. Even we did have a strat. We said, we're like, he's right to the down. He's strat of right now. safe before i even started this game i kind of wanted to be in like the middle kind of cooling kind of seeing you know i didn't want to oddly enough i didn't want to be at the top but i also didn't want to be at the very bottom so i'm satisfied with being in the safe group knowing that i don't have to risk being like the first person that gets into the void i feel good about being in the safe group that i can't get voted off i'm scared for those who will get voted off and moving forward potentially getting voted off how how much how many how long do you have in school? Hey Ella. Hi Ella. Hi Ella. What's up? Not much. Actually happy to meet uh, Ella. I didn't know it was more people in the group, so I'm glad to know it's more people. Ella, hi, I'm Karachikio. Nice to meet you. Hi, nice to meet you. Is it hey, Ella, what's I your am. zodiac sign? I am a Virgo. Okay. I was curious if everybody's zodiac. Capricorn and Armani's a Libra. Yeah, Ooh, you so we're all different. Yes, I definitely remember. How do I feel about Kara Chigio? She is amazing. I love her. She's so outgoing and so free spirited and just super kind. That I like that we're the safe group too. That's good. Yeah, it's about being in the safe group. I'm happy. I am I'm too. <laughs> <laughs> like I feel like like we won't be, we can't be picked to be in the void, but it doesn't secure us to like move forward and not be put in the void. So it kind of puts the level for the game. Right. I think that's going to be fun. Oh my gosh. I think it's getting so spicy in the other groups. You think so? It was hard. Yeah. Most of them just like stared <laughs> <laughs> and like didn't speak. Like yesterday that, I was in a group with like six people and like three of us spoke the whole time basically. What? Yeah. I feel like me and Karashikia were in the same group um yesterday or last night. Yeah. I feel like we had yeah. a good conversation. Yeah, the only person that was quiet was Manu. Like yeah. he didn't really say much. Yeah. I was in a group with he him said. the other day and it was me and one girl just chatting away and he was just like watching us. What? He didn't talk? <laughs> No, he really didn't. <laughs> he looked at us and we were just like blabbing away and then he was like, oh, and he would say something wicked random, but it was like so funny. But then her and I would talk about what he That's said. That's how Yeah. And it was so weird. Or I feel like that it's... Oh, that's interesting. Okay. I know. Okay. Interesting. Hmm. Right. I mean, honestly, I thought Kara Chikio would kind of get a higher rating than me because she's just, it's so easy to have a conversation with her. I feel like she's the type of person that everybody can kind of talk to or she's a good like conversationalist. So I thought that she would get a higher rating. So I don't know, it makes me feel good that we're in the same group. We're in the safe group. 
And yeah, we are all just coast, and I'm glad me, Ella, and Kara Cheeky all got to coast together. My opinion of Armani has not changed since first meeting. She's still super happy and super bubbly and just the same person I met the first night. Honestly, I'm not gonna lie. I obviously see myself as a five, but I also know that they only know so much. So I could kind of see how I got a 3.96, but of course I see myself as a five on a scale from one to five, but I'm just glad to like just not be at the bottom and the first person getting sent into the void. And I also noticed that my grade was kind of higher than Ellen Karachikio, so I, like I said, I wanted to be in the middle, but it makes me feel a little better to know that, okay, like this is my grade of 3.96, and I'm kind of almost like at the top of the middle or at the top of being safe. I feel like there's still a couple of people, at least like one or two that I haven't met yet. Yeah. Especially like, I so. cause I only met two guys, Chris and Manu. I had I've two met... guys in my last one that weren't either of them. Oh, really? I've, yeah. Yeah, I've met two, I've met four guys all together. Really? Yeah, I've met. Yeah. Yeah, I've met four together. Okay, I wonder who I haven't met yet. I don't know. Or I wonder like what other girls there are that I haven't met. Mm, it might be girls. Mm -hmm. Yeah, I don't know. We'll just have to see. We'll just have to keep playing and see. <laughs> yeah, we'll have to keep playing and see. I think Hannah was in the Power Players for sure. Every time I was in a group with her, she was always one to initiate conversations. So we're the lowest rated, huh? I guess so. Mm-hmm. How do y'all feel about that? I don't know. Honestly, it's whatever. It's kind of just... Yeah. Yeah. yeah you know, I, I feel like you can't change people's ways of, like, rating you, you know? Yeah, I agree. Hey. Hey, Hello. man. Hi. How are you? I'm okay. How are y'all? I'm okay. Mm -hmm. Okay, so what does our group mean exactly? I think out of the three days, we were rated the lowest in total. It's it sounds really sad saying it out loud. Mm -hmm. Yeah. <laughs> I thought I was going to get lucky and, you know, be rated higher this time. Let's see what and um but i wasn't so i was a little um disappointed but it was also nice to be around familiar faces actually um i don't really like get how i understand how i made it there because like i was pretty nice to everyone like i kind of tried to be talkative like i wasn't like the most talkative in every single group but like i was trying to get to know people trying to like be a little like chit chatty so that other people would talk more and I could get to know them. So I guess I was like a little confused, like well, like what did I do to get here? But like I don't really mind it. I was kind of like, okay, like I'm really just seeing how this all plays out. Like I know for me, like I didn't talk as much as a lot of other people. A lot of people were super like loud and out there and so mm -hmm. that could be why. Yeah, I don't know like what exactly I did to get through here because like in the majority, like all through the night, I was like, talking to everyone. Yeah. Um, I kind of like get why they were there in a way because like most of the people in their group weren't that talkative when I was with them and they weren't like, it's not like they did anything to stand out particularly. Um, maybe I didn't talk as much as other people and so they didn't really get a sense of who I was. Um, so yeah, I mean, I can't really change who I am. Interesting. Interesting. Hmm. Shelby, you got the highest. <laughs> Good job. Mm -hmm. <laughs> still, still low though. Mm -hmm. I mean, that's like the middle. I feel like that's middle, right? Because the highest that you could was five. Yeah. Right. Mm -hmm. So that was like right about in the middle. It's not bad. Mm -hmm. Poor JJ. 
Yeah. He didn't really talk much though. Like even like yeah. yesterday, like we would be like all talking like, oh, like how was your day? And, like everyone would like go around and be like, oh, great, fine, mm. whatever. And like he would just <laughs> not say anything, <laughs> you yeah. know? So it's like. Yeah, I felt bad because I knew he was at work though. Yeah. Yeah. So oh, like... he was at work yesterday? Mm-hmm. Yeah. Oh, 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 that makes sense. Maybe I was too, maybe I was being too nice. And maybe I was a little awkward at times, so they graded me lower. I was a little, um, like, disappointed in my grade because, like, I was nice to everyone. I, like, talked to everyone. Like, I personally graded the majority of the people I was with, like, good because it's, like, they gave me no reason not to. So I was, like, a little confused when I had such a low grade because I was, like, okay, like, who in here was, like, not voting me good, you know? Like, I was kind of, like, surprised that I was, like, one of the lowest voted players because, like, I think I'm pretty likable. Like, I'm, like, a nice person. It was a little, I was a little, like, my things were a little hurt. I guess I'm awkward, uh, right? So I don't, maybe I don't talk as much. You know, I tried to crack some jokes, and I did make some people laugh, I think. But, yeah, I guess it just didn't work. I wasn't funny enough. Can you hear me? Yeah. yeah. Some of the uh, days um, that I were video chatting, I wasn't talking that much because I was at work and I have to pay attention to those who were in the um, like at my job. Thoughts? Um, so we all we have to save one person? Like we're just choosing? Yeah. We have to pick one. I feel like we have to think like the power players and think logically like, like think about like our ratings. I would assume that the lowest person would be in danger, so that's who I would put to save. Because I, then no one goes. True. But like I- I thought that's why we're all in here, because we are the lowest players. Oh, but okay. So before, oh yeah, you can go ahead. Yeah, you can okay. go ahead if you want. Okay, so before um you got on, it showed what? all of our like average scores. Oh, for okay, real? There you go. Yeah, you're oh, the lowest. Dang. <laughs> <laughs> oh my. Okay. Okay. Yeah. So if you want, we could lift you up and yeah. help you out. <laughs> we can save you. Yes. Too many people are trying to just kick us out the game so soon so early. Like I don't know what's going on. Like what do we do with these people? <laughs> I don't know if they get to know like what our rankings are, Ours. or like yeah. So, hmm. or like if the power players even were the ones that like voted lower for certain people i don't know but that's what i would do so we pre-pick somebody who's safe from the void and if we pick right they won't go like, so what like, if we pick wrong yeah the person they said would go so yeah okay okay we can pick jj keep you up mm-hmm. <laughs> <laughs> there it is. JJ was saved because I feel like we all showed compassion by letting him, um, by saving him because he was the lowest. Um, I thought it was a good group decision. I felt relieved. I felt great. But we all saved JJ. So maybe he was supposed to be sent and we actually saved him and so no one went. That's what I'm hoping. Hello. Wow! Hey, Chris. What's up? Look at us, all of us from night two, making reuniting again. Yeah, yeah. This is the winner circle, all right? <laughs> yes. <laughs> I wasn't expecting that email at all. I was like, oof. I know. I wasn't expecting being a power player either. I found out that I was a power player. I honestly went 
screaming through the house, oh my gosh, oh my gosh, like I'm a power player. Ideally, it's not where I want it to be because the middle was ideal for the start of the game and I really didn't expect to be a power player from the start of the game. Call me for a loop, honestly, I was shocked, shocked, baffled, you name it. Um, but I was also super excited my reaction to learning that I was a power player was I was kind of surprised just because I thought I'd be somewhere more middle in the middle of the pack just because I don't know I'm more of an easygoing person so I didn't think I would get into that position of a power player. The three, um, the three of the people were all the people that were in my group the first night. So it's crazy. I'm like the only one not from that group not in the bottom. Oh, That's they just accepted. The only one I knew was Erin, and I've had like multiple like interactions with her. So that's the only one mm -hmm. I knew. I was like, I don't know these people. I only know Shelby and Erin. Yeah, I can. Oh, I can tell you about the other three if you want, just so you can like get a feel. If like from what I learned about them, if you want, like their age and like what kind of. Sure. I can tell you, like so. JJ is I think forty something. Damn. Um. He, he was like really funny. That's like what I said in my thing was that he was just really funny. Um, Alex was I think twenty, upper twenties, mid twenties I think, and then he was really shy. And then Hannah was nineteen. I think think she's in like her. She's she graduating. She seemed like a senior in high school. I think graduating, and she was just like really chill. She didn't really. She was like leading the conversations, kind of, out of the four of us. So that would so be if that gives you any an eighteen year old. Yeah, well, since she was nineteen, so I don't know. I hmm. left back. To Maybe like an older senior. <laughs> okay. Yeah. Wow. So that's kind of like the gist. I, I kind of. So I don't know what I else. I felt like there was like one other guy I didn't know that I never met. But like, I also thought that it could have been three other girls. Yeah, like I've never met Shelby. If you guys have met her, do you know? Yeah. Um, Shelby, keeps um, she's, she's a little um, quiet, but she's she's definitely uh, like talkative. Like when, when we have a con when we have topics going on. Okay. Oh. Hey, oh hello. Hi. Hi. What's going on, power player? I was most surprised to see Menu. I was not expecting that at all. Kind of shocked me. Second shocker of the day. But I was not expecting Menu to be a power player. And he was like late, so we didn't know who the power player was going to be. And when we find that, found that out, I think we all had the same reaction of like, oh. Menu, on the other hand, what a curveball. I thought I was going to be voting him out. I was not surprised to learn I was in the power player group because I have been in the highest ranked group every night. I was also not surprised that Chris and Alexia were power players because it seemed like everyone likes them. Imagine this is uh Wow, look at us go. Oh wow. Wow. Got those above fours. We did that. Proud of us. Mm -hmm. But I was in the number two spot. So that's super exciting. I'm just going to continue to be myself. I was shook. Again. I mean, I definitely didn't think I'd be in the top, like the number one player. I mean, I didn't even think I was going to be in the top four at all. It was the lowest in the power player group. I was very thrown off by that. I thought that my round one grade would be perfect five. Um, I'm that's so crazy. That's wild that someone out there is rating me below five. I can't believe it. Wow. Well, I feel like this is an accomplishment. Oh. The leader. <laughs> I was about to say, I was like, I don't know if I want my number one over there to be showing right now. <laughs> no, what if they show that to all the other, what if they show this leaderboard to all the other groups? We're going to be through it. 
4.63. Not the place I want it to be. I kind of want it to be in the middle. Better to be in the safe group, in all honesty. But hey, maybe being a power player gives me my advantages, right? Let's see how that goes. But definitely did not want to be number one, like I read. Come on, come on. I tried to go under the radar, and honestly, I know that I didn't do a great, great job. I, I do have quite the personality, even if I tone it down. Like, if I was another person, I would always be giving me fives for everything. So, Manu, who do you know out of the not safe group? I... I just know Aaron and Hannah. Okay, wow, we do not have enough information here, guys. This is going to be a yeah. red place. See. Yeah, I, mean, so, I think Aaron you know, and, and Alex are safe just because of personalities that I hear. So, like, yeah. which of them do you all know? Aaron? I know Aaron and Shelby. And I know Aaron, Hannah, Alex, and JJ. So, I think we should ask Sasha first, because she knows the most four out of five. Well, okay, so do you guys want to eliminate, like, shyer people, or do you want to eliminate, like, people that could potentially be threat? Like, what way do you want to go with this? Maybe we should make, like, pros and cons. I think, some, I think somewhere in okay. the middle. Because I don't know if I want to eliminate shy people. Middle? Because- I feel like I want to get to know the Shire people. Mm-hmm. Yeah. Okay, so I none of you know Alex, so I'll, I told the Chris and Alex already, but Alex was just kind of, he was kind of shy. He didn't really talk much. Um, he was like mid-20s, I would say, age, and he was just kind of cool. He didn't really say much, and he said he didn't have a strat or anything. So I don't know if we would want to kick him off, because I feel like he's, he's shy, so I feel like we could keep him. Okay, so that's a shy one. Also, I, I meant JJ and Aaron when I said Alex and Aaron. I meant JJ and Aaron. <laughs> because, oh, you meant JJ? Okay. Yeah. And then, Manu, you said you knew Hannah. What did you get from Hannah? Like, what do you think about her? Um, Hannah. Well, I don't know. So I was in the group with me and Hannah and Alpha, and they were just like, telling all these crazy stories and I was kind of quiet um I just like got that she's crazy yeah that's the vibe I kind of got she was telling me about like stories and stuff she seemed like out of all the people that were in that group though like the biggest threat I would say just because she was a little more confident and like was leading a lot of the conversations and stuff when you say crazy stories, what I am intrigued to find out what that means. <laughs> um, like she's just telling me about how like she she used to jump out of her window all the time, like at night. Ooh. She her, just like to sneak out. Like sneak out through the window, and I'm like, ooh, she's that sounds, that sounds crazy. Sweet. Yeah, she was telling me how she got to go like on stage at a Kodak Black concert and stuff. Or like, she was in the front row and they like asked them to go up because they like, it sounded like fun. I mean, but she just goes to a lot of concerts and gets to like talk to the people. I mean, I'm I'm in between right now based on all the information between Alex Hannah and Shelby. Well, I would like to keep Aaron and Hannah because they're the ones that I know. At first, I was kind of shocked because when you were talking about people, Manu said he didn't want to vote off people that he had met because he had only met two of the five people that were in the group, and he just didn't want to vote off the people he met just for the reason that he already knew them, which all three of us were kind of like, you're already forming an allies already. Manu came in, and he knew that he wanted to save the two people that he knew, and then Chris and Sasha, like, none of us knew the same people, so it was more so a process of elimination. Oh, you're going to alliances now, man? That's too early in the game for that. <laughs> <laughs> I, don't, I don't know Shelby or JJ or Alex, so, like, I don't care about keeping them. 
Hannah was Manu save, which damn, that is exactly why you shouldn't be a power player, because that is a threat. Even though I do want to get to know her, that is a threat. Arrogance and experience are always a threat. Chris did seem suspicious that I did not want to get rid of Hannah or Aaron. He might have thought that we had an alliance, but I'm not really sure if we do have an alliance. I was just not wanting to get rid of the people I know. Um, but who knows if like they will protect me in the same way. Oh man, you made mm -hmm. a person, you made that personal connection already? I see you. Okay. Yeah. Uh, okay, so what if we just go down the list? Like, how do we, like, a yes or no, like, with Aaron, like, a yes or a no, and then we can go to, like, the next person? I don't know. Mm -hmm. Yeah. I mean, I mean, we have to establish who we want to keep. It makes it easier that way. So I think we all establish we for sure want to keep Aaron. Is yeah. Like, for sure. Yeah, that's okay. a pretty good consensus. She's pet. I feel like, um, Manu didn't hear the part where JJ is a hilarious 40 year old guy. <laughs> yeah, he was pretty funny. Like, I was entertained by him. So I feel like I would just keep him for even, like, he was just funny. Like, kept the conversation, like, funny and lighthearted. So I would keep him personally. Okay. okay. So then, if that were the case, to be between Hannah, Shelby, and Alex. So, Maddie wants to keep Hannah, so... Oh, well, that just leaves Shelby and Alex then. It was, it was very easy to get what I wanted, which was to save Hannah and Aaron. Um, and, like, the other three people, I didn't care, like, who they picked to send to the void because I didn't know them. So we ended up doing the process of elimination and Alex and Shelby ended up being the last two after everyone talked about who they wanted to keep and so that's just who we put in for the void. We, I, honestly, no hard feelings. I don't know them, but it wasn't like anything personal. It's just more so like nobody knew the same people. So we just had to make a decision. It didn't quite go my way. Why? Because from their descriptions, I would have more preferred Hannah to go. Even though I do want to get to know her, she's an interesting character that I've learned about based on the stories. A little arrogant, seemingly. Don't want to judge too early because I've never met her. Oh. Oh. Well. Uh -huh. I guess. Oh, well, Alright. And two people are still going. <laughs> Shocker! Look. Oh man. Alright. On night four, the remaining 10 players in the game had to rate each other on decision making. They only rated the players in their groups. Man, you definitely got the low score. I can't. Sorry, decision making. You didn't make any decisions. Never have. Never talked. And I gave Sasha a four in regards to decision making. I feel like she still puts thought into her decisions. Chris a four, which is what I usually give him because he is a good leader. And then I just think there could be a better leader, which I think would be Alexia. I feel like the both of them aren't exactly fives, but I also know that they aren't threes either, kind of in the middle of that scale. So I just gave a four because I think they can make good decisions. The night four grades start a clean slate for everybody. The 
lowest grades are the non-threats. The middle grades are in the middle, and the top grades are potential power players. But first, we must check out... I was sent to the void. That was that was what was really shocking to me. It's fine. I don't know why. I really don't know why I was sent to the void, but maybe I'll maybe I'll know soon. I would like to know why. Yeah, I think it's important for me and whoever else is in the void with me to come up with a strategy right away because uh, I think it would be cool if we partnered up, if we teamed up and we had each other's backs because obviously we don't want to be in the void together or in the void at all so it would be smart for the two of us to team up and work together. Alex! Hey Shelby. I would say it's good to see you but not under these circumstances. Right? I'm surprised. I feel pretty good about being in the void with Shelby because she's nice and we get along and I don't really see her as a threat or anything. Well, that's okay. That just means the two of us are going to be pals. <laughs> yes. You were our highest graded member last that's night, the, right? That's yeah. the only reason why I was surprised. Oh, wow. They saw, probably saw you as a threat. Maybe. What'd you do today? Oh. Oh. Nice. Fine. That sounds interesting. That's always fun. <laughs> No, I didn't really do anything. I went. I got on a plane and uh, I had to drive, uh, take a flight to Atlanta. So I'm here right now. Oh, okay. <laughs> yeah. Atlanta, if you don't mind me asking. Well, why? Um, because I'm doing something for like one of a condition I have. It. It. They're just basically studying me. It's what. It's for a study that, for a condition that I have. Oh, okay. Yeah. So being in the void with Alex, at first I was a little skeptical about it. I thought it'd be weird and we wouldn't have anything to talk about, but it was actually really comforting. At least it was a familiar face and um, uh, during it, you know, I think we bonded. Hmm. I didn't get all that up there. We get to choose someone to visit us for the void. Oh, cool. But they can deny the invitation. Oh, well, why would they do that? There was this girl in my first group who I really liked. Uh huh. And I think she got rated really highly because I haven't seen her since. Oh, first. okay. So I might invite her. I chose Armani to visit me because. I think we really bonded the first night, or I really, she really took a like, I really took a liking to her. It's by Salem. Yeah, I would hope to learn, you know, how to be more likable. Like, what is she doing that I'm not, and maybe I can. And also, what she, who has she met? Like, what does she think about them? You know, I, I, it, I think it'd be really good to um, have her in the void. I think we could get a lot. Um, I think me and Alex could both gain a lot by having her in the void with us. So, I'll, I'll do one from our my first group too. Okay. Yeah. I chose to invite Sasha to the void because I was in a group with her already the first day, and I haven't seen her since. So that tells me she's probably doing well because um, she hasn't been in the groups that I've been in since then, and I've been in all the lower ranked or gr lower rated groups. I feel like I definitely have gotten more strategic already and I'm starting, um, I definitely will be able to strategize in the coming days. And I think Alex is the same way. I think we both, I think we're kind of similar in a sense. 
um, in just the way that we, the way that we operate and the way that we, we speak to one another. From Sasha, I hope to learn uh, who are the main, the major players. I was pretty happy that I wasn't set to the void because I was like, okay, I just keep going downhill. Like first I was a leader and I was like, yeah, like I'm a leader. And then it was like bad decision maker. And I was like, mm, okay, like not the best turn of events. And then it was like in the not safe group. Like I just kept going like downhill and I was like, okay, well next stop is the void. So I'm kind of happy that I avoided the void. What did, what was these videos like for you yesterday? Yesterday, it was well, there's like how many like six of us, right? There was well, I think it was four, five or five. five, five of us total last night. I was surprised to be in the lowest ranked group because the criteria for last night was who is a good decision maker, and I think that I am a good decision maker, and I have done nothing to suggest to other people that I'm not a good decision maker so i think that that means someone is not grading truthfully if i had to guess it's probably chris doing that honestly i wasn't surprised i was in the non-threat group considering the night before i was in the non-safe group and i also thought it might be my fault that us three are here because uh, yesterday I might have suggested or made, made it seem like us three had an alliance and so maybe everyone was like threatened by me, Hannah, and Aaron. So did they, did they tell you that they sent people to the void? Who did they, we, we don't know who got sent to the void. We were in like the... The, what group were you in last night? I was in the power players group. Oh. What was it like in there? So we were discussing which of the five of you to send to the void. So how many did you get to pick? Two. Who oh, did you, who, who did everyone pick? So it's um, it's Alex and Shelby. Ooh. Interesting. So we thought, we just figured it would be JJ. So it was kind of s surprising that it was Alex and Shelby. Um, but yeah, I don't know. Hopefully they get a chance to come back. Who else was in the group with you? Uh, it was like- Like who were the power players? It was Chris and Sasha and Alexia. I haven't met Chris or Alexia. Okay. I, I think I know Everyone. Yeah, I think I've met everyone, so yeah. Okay. Yeah. I know you are Sasha. like the, the only person that they all knew was Aaron, so we all like agreed to not send her to the void and the Aww. rest of you we were like talking about. When Manu said that everyone in the power players group knew me and wanted to save me, that made me feel a lot better though about being in the uh, non threat group and the not safe group. Um I guess having different people literally every single night paid off in that fact. Oh, thank you. I really appreciate that. <laughs> <laughs> like only a couple of us knew each person. And like, mm -hmm. so I was like, okay, I don't know Alex and Shelby and JJ, so I don't really care if we send them to the void. And like, then Chris was like, Okay, I don't know. Or Chris wanted to save JJ, so then, and then I was saved you, Hannah. So then we sent Shelby and Alex to the void. I feel kind of good that he saved me, cause like, uh, to my come to my knowledge, that like a lot of the people in the power play group I hadn't even met yet. So like I was very close to being sent down to the void because half of them didn't know me and they were just kind of going they were picking who to send down there based off of who they didn't know yeah i know i every time i've played with someone though i've given everyone that i've played with like good scores so it's like... yeah like i've given people like generally good scores like it kind of depends on like what it was for like even with like when we were rating the people for like their decision making 
Mm-hmm. Like, maybe since you got the, like, good decision maker, I didn't have to rate you. But Ella, you guys still gave her, like, a four. Because I was like, oh, okay. Well, like, me and her are about on the same, like, you know, like, ideas of, like, decision making. And, like, I'm okay at making them. I was like, I'm going to give her a four. You know, like, I generally mm-hmm. give people, like, decent ratings. Yeah, so I can give you guys, yeah. like, ones. That makes sense. <laughs> So I was like, dude, like, I rated you, or I didn't even rate him. I didn't have to rate him, because we set him. We lifted him up. We are like, here you go. You can be the good decision maker. Manny, pat on the back. And then he just kind of, like, threw me down with a one. Like, it was kind of mean. Kind of dirty. He's playing dirty. So. I think I'm too nice with my grading, though. Yeah. I feel like that's probably why I'm always... I mean, I wasn't always in the non-threat group. The mm-hmm. second night, I was actually in the middle of the pack. He told me that he's rating everyone low. Like that just like messed up his whole strategy. Cause he could have been a smooth sailor until he said that. And that is where he messed up. Hey, I'm hello. hello. <laughs> What's up girl? Nothing. I had a feeling I would see you again. You think so? Queen Ella. Hi Ella. Hi. <laughs> Hi. <laughs> What's up? Nothing. Not much. <laughs> Nothing. <laughs> Glad to see both of you back in my group again. Yay! Let me the three of us again. I thought, um, I was actually glad to see them again. I also thought that the group would be different, which technically I guess it was supposed to be because I think JJ was supposed to be in there or something like that. I feel great about being in the middle group with Ella and Armani. I'm happy that I'm back with the same people. I'm kind of upset that JJ didn't show up, but I'm hoping that everything is still good. Oh, wow. Uh, who wanna go? I think you should go, Karachikyo. Me? I think I you think should so because too. you're very good at like talking to people. Yes. Yeah, you always <laughs> and I like finding out information. <laughs> you're, you can even talk to anyone, so I feel like you should go. Okay. We vote you. I feel like I, maybe I should have discussed it with them more, but instantly I was like, Kachiki would be great for this because she's so good at like starting conversations, talking to people. Just, I feel like she's good at talking. I feel like she's better at talking than me and Ella. Uh, glad to be chosen to infiltrate the potential power players. I don't know. I don't know. Oh, that's Daniel. Oh, our money! <laughs> <laughs> Go have fun. That's gonna be so fun. I can't. Ooh. Well, that's interesting because I wonder who it is. Yeah, me I too. Who I wonder to what they want to know. know. Yeah. What are you gonna ask the power players? I'm gonna ask them how, like, what they think they did to get there, get there, and how, like, check out their personality and their vibe, and ask them. Um, like, um, is it their first time there, or what have they done to stay there? That's what y'all yeah. told me to ask. Yeah. Okay. I know I remember. You gotta, <laughs> you gotta, that's, that's, that's so funny. You gotta let me know who's there, because I have no idea. Kara Chikio, you're going on a mission? What, tonight? You're going on a mission, too. Mommy- find out who's in the void. Yes, find out who's in the void. Find out who else is in the void with them right. and ask them who they think voted them bad grades. I want to know who they think voted them down. I want to I want to know who's in it. Me too. I'm honestly wondering if Karachikio is giving people crap ratings because she asked, we were discussing like what would we say when we go to the other group and she says ask them who they think gave them bad ratings and like the way that she said it kind of makes me think that she's the person giving people bad ratings or is like sending people to helping send people to the board or whatever like she's i'm getting like a vibe that she might kind of be part in that so i don't know i'm gonna have to like keep an 
an eye out, even though like I'm kind of blind and my prescription isn't that strong. I'm gonna have to keep an eye out for that. Yes, yes, we gotta that. report that. Get all the info. So, and that's the yeah. secret detective. <laughs> right, and then we're gonna find out who's a potential player, a power player. I need to get in, find as much information as possible, and to see how they're working on their gameplay. What's up? Hey. Oh. Again. What's up? I mean, this is the potential power players group, not surprised. Yeah. I am a little surprised at who was kept, just because if we had a clean slate, um, the other groups should have chosen fives and they should have been up there. But hey, I'm also not surprised Alexia and Sasha are there, just because, hey, they are likable people. I was nominated again to be a potential power player and I believe that that puts a target on my back and people are going to start coming for me. And Manu, I knew that he probably wasn't going to be in, in the same group as us because like Chris was saying he's really shy. We were all just kind of shocked that he was in a power player to begin with. Um, kind of glad all of us are stuck together. Yeah, together since night two. Hey, it's gonna get worse. Remember, this is just round two. <laughs> yeah. Yeah, I feel like there's no telling what tonight's gonna bring. Yeah, I'm not sure, because, like, what are we? Are we just doing the same thing, and we had to, like, pick a, or no. I guess we picked the leader to find the potential power players, but we're already the potential power players. I don't know. I feel like we should start strategizing. Although there's nothing to strategize, I feel like we should consider strategizing. Yeah. Like, who, like, what kind of type of people we want to get out of the game and like what kind of people we want to keep in. Yeah. Oh. Oh. Hi hello. guys. <laughs> yeah. Hello. How's everybody doing? Great. Good. I was wondering if I'm there was a <laughs> Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> Kiara Shikito, finally, welcome to the Power Player Group. Honestly, I thought you were going to be there last time instead, Manu. So I have some questions for you guys. What? <laughs> it's just some questions that I want to ask. Nick didn't put me up to it or anything. <laughs> what you sound did very you guys suspicious think? now. Uh, I said what? You sound extremely suspicious now. I know. What are you gonna add? No, 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 no. no. And my thoughts on Kira Shakita were she was being really kind of like shady, not shady, but like suspicious because as soon as she came out she's like well I have some questions to ask you and like Nick didn't put me up to this so it was just kind of interesting why she was asking us these questions it kind of sounded like she was really trying to get into our places and like asking us how we got to be power players and what we did to like get there no, okay no. so like what do you guys think y'all did to become a power player I'm Nothing. <laughs> I, I just gotta be myself because right. I don't know. Look, I was shocked. Yeah, me too. Okay. I was nice. thinking, like I didn't really have a strategy. I was just kind of being myself, and then here you are. <laughs> yeah, Man, people are born magnetic. Yeah. Sometimes it's learned, but mostly it's because it's a personality. Okay, cool, cool. Kira, Kira Cheek to Toe, um, she was also a potential power player, which surprised me, but um, it's good to see a familiar face. I honestly, at first I thought she was in there to just gather information, like you know how we can drop into the void or people can see people from the void. I thought possibly it was that. She just came off a little strong when she first got on, so I was a little confused in what her goal was. Now what I've been thinking right now is that everybody's on edge. I mean, Kiara Shikato is definitely probing questions and I honestly am a little, little wary of her. So what are you guys doing to stay here? Just being more you than you could be? I don't know. We haven't really talked about it since like... No. I yeah. feel like I'm completely know. surprised um, uh, at my score. I'm just like, I didn't do anything for that score. Yeah. <laughs> right. That's I feel funny. Like 
early in the game like i feel like we like would need to strategize but it's also so early in the game like yesterday was the first time anybody really had to do anything yeah true very true how was it chilling in the safe group it was nice, <laughs> <laughs> it was like, nice. Five. so what was y'all scores can y'all tell me y'all scores Am I not allowed to I was a 3.86, which isn't bad. That's actually surprising. Was, mm-hmm. Yeah. Hey, I'm a support. I think. I'm, Sorry. I, I'm just going to say that I got the, the, the higher score. <laughs> yeah. So I guess technically he was the le- our leader. He's the leader? Yeah. Yes. Okay, cool. Mm-hmm. I think uh, <laughs> you didn't put that information there. You look, you look a little devious there, huh? Oh no, she's I like, that, I saw that glimmer in your eyes. Oh man, I got a wild chance for this one. You're hilarious. Why would you not trust me? <laughs> Everybody <laughs> loves Chris. Come on, Chris. Come on, those were some pretty uh, not too decent tactics to get information out of everybody just to come up with your own strategies in your head. I mean, I, like I said, I saw a glimmer in the eye as soon as, you know, she saw, she heard my score. Oh my God, my score is a tired excuse of a target on my back. That's why I didn't want to be first. Nope, I, f- I feel targets on my back right now, so. I should tell Armani and Ella for sure so they know what's going on. Ooh. 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 Ooh, you're the first one to go <laughs> in. Oh, shoot. Nice. Do I have a strategy? It has to be, have been Alex then because I never met Shelby. Unless oh. for some reason you just wanted to meet someone named Sasha. I don't, I don't know. It's definitely Alex. Yeah, and I only met him once, too. Oh, man. Oh, man. That, that means they all know. <laughs> yeah, so they all know who the power players are or who the last round. Sasha, are you gonna go to the void? Question yeah, what, what am I supposed to, what do I do in the void? Like, are they gonna interrogate me? Yes, absolutely. The players had to grade each other on how memorable everybody they have met so far was. The first players that come to mind should be rated 5 or 4. The last players that come to mind should be rated 2 or 1. Like, if I could remember their name, I can remember their face, therefore I remember them. I gave Alexi a five, just because I'm a big fan of Alexi. I think she's really nice and sweet, and for me, that's what I remember someone by, is if they're nice and someone I can get along with. They come to my mind very easily. I've connected with them on multiple occasions. I gave a five to Kiari Chiquito because um, she, she's she been the most memorable person. She has such a unique name and a unique personality. Chris, I gave a five, of course. I don't know. I feel like I'm just like super rooting for Chris. He's just an easygoing person, I feel like. Armani, too. Armani's personality definitely stayed in my head. I knew her right away. And then, you know, Kiar Shikato is up there as well. I definitely think I've been grading way too nicely. I tried to, today, change up my grading a little bit and be a little more, like, strict about it, but I have been giving everyone, like, three fours and fives. And I think that's why, um, because everyone else has been grading, like, normally. So I've been giving high grades, but everyone else has been giving average low grades. Who else even is there? Like, is that everyone? Or have I even met other people? Are there even other people who exist in the game? And then I'm like, oh yeah, there's Sasha and Armani. And I told, it's hard to remember them. So I gave them once because they're not very memorable. The highest grades on night six are the new power players. 
The lowest grades are not safe and could be voted out by the power players. But first, let's check out who's visiting the void. Why did they freaking invite me? I have no idea. Um, for a second, like initially the first person that popped in my head was Manu. I personally don't think that he would call me to the void. Like who the heck would call me to the void? I thought about it a little more. I, I'm an overthinker. I've kind of been thinking about this. What if it's Shelby? Because I just had like a feeling after I just said that. So it might be Shelby. Because I haven't heard from her since the very first night, like the very first night. I don't wanna, I'm not gonna open my eyes yet. I wanna, I wanna guess who it is without me opening my eyes first. Okay. <laughs> Wait, like say some stuff, I think I can guess. Um, I'm a Libra and uh, I was in your group the first night. Is it Shelby? Yes. Hey! Hey, Alex! Hi, Armani. I was like, I was like, I heard a guy's voice, voice but it turned into a girl. <laughs> <laughs> I thought it would just be one person. No, I was surprised there were two people too. I thought it was just gonna be me. Were y'all in the void last night? Mm -hmm. Yeah. How the heck did y'all get in here? I don't know. <laughs> how the heck? I haven't met you yet, Alex. But Shelby, how did you get in here? I don't know. I thought you might have been one of the power players. No, I'm in, I'm just in the middle. Like I'm just like cool right now. Like in the middle of the pack in the safe group. Oh, I wanted to be there. What is going on? I don't know. Uh, the chat with Armani went well. Um, it was so nice getting to see her, getting to speak with her. Um, I think I think she enjoyed being invited to the void too. I think we got to talk a lot of things out. What the heck? I think it might have been because they don't know me, because I don't know anyone in the power of players. I don't think so. I'm, I'm legit trying to think. I don't know. I don't really know anybody in the power player group either. I think Chris is in it, but I don't know. It's just like mm -hmm. a, a guessing game right now. Mm -hmm. I thought for sure that I would see. Have y'all met Manu? Mm -mm. I, well, he, I met him not too long ago, and he like doesn't talk. So I thought he would be in here. <laughs> I think I heard about him. Someone else said there was someone who didn't talk the whole time. <laughs> oh my gosh. I don't even know what to say because you're the last person that I would expect to be in here. Anna, I don't know if you've met her. Oh, sorry, I'm more guys. I'm not used to it being this early. I always thought they were after 10, so I just checked my email to see what time. I was like, shoot. <laughs> hey, Sasha. Hey, Armani, haven't seen you in a minute. I know, we're like all trying to figure this out. Hi, Sasha, I haven't met you yet. I'm Hi, Shelby. Shelby. Nice to meet you. Nice to meet you. Okay, Sasha, are you a power player? I was, but tonight I'm gonna get, I'm probably gonna get eliminated. I'm in the not safe group tonight. Wow. Yeah. Hold on, I gotta yeah. take So I was a power player and now I'm like the opposite. Okay, who was in your group as a power player? It was me, Manu, <laughs> and Alexia. I'm sorry, okay, you, Manu, Alexia, and who? Chris. Okay, I figured yeah. Chris was a power player. Yeah. He's probably cheesing right now, like, oh. <laughs> oh yeah, yeah. I feel like he's on the top again, too, because he had the highest score out of everyone in our group. Right. Like, really? mm -hmm. He had like a 4.8 or something. Something like really high. Did Manu talk? Hardly. <laughs> I'm sorry. I think he rated so high. <laughs> yeah, that's what we were wondering because we he was late. Like he was late to the power player chat, so we were like, who could it be? We were trying to guess like who it could be, but none of us guessed him to be like the last power player because he was so quiet. Interesting. That's what I thought. That's who would be in the void. But I was also like, he wouldn't call me to be in the void so I was like it can't be him 
Yeah. But I didn't know. I didn't think that he'd be a power player. How is he? Okay, what is really going on? He is finessing. And it was really interesting, too, like, how we had to vote off the power players. Like, because Manu, he was like, well, I just want to keep the people that I know. Like, he didn't really, he wasn't, like, participating because he just kept saying he's like, I just want to keep the people I know. But, like, you can't do that. Like, I knew four of the five people, so I couldn't just keep the people I knew. Like, right. And Alexia only knew one person that was in the void. And Chris only knew two. It was, like, the only, she was the only person who knew me or something like that. So, yeah, it's fine. I mean, if you have to go with people, you have to go with people. I get it. Wait, so y'all are like voting people to the void? Or yeah, is that's it- what we had to do. We had to just, we all had to, at least three of us had to decide on the same people to vote off. And the only way we did it, cause like we, we didn't know what we were doing really. So we just kind of went with the people that the least of us knew. And only Chris knew you shall be. And I was the only one that knew Alex. So that way it like, that's oh, that's that what I thought. Yeah, it was just because Manu was just really like, well, I don't want to vote off people I already know. So we were like, okay, I guess we'll keep those people because he was like putting up a fight about it. So we don't want to like start anything. So we are like, okay, we'll just do the people that we least collectively know. Well, looks like Manu does talk then. Okay. Yeah, that's all he did say. He was like, I want to keep the people I know. And we were like, you're making allies already. Like, isn't it kind of early for that? Who did he know? Aaron and Hannah, I think. Hey, Sasha, who are some people we should be looking out for? Um, definitely Chris. He's been, in, he was in every power player. I think everyone really likes Chris, so I would definitely look out for him just because he's like in the lead and he had the highest points. And I think he's a really good, like with people pleasing. And I know Kira Chiquito is really like in it to win it. She was in my group last night with me and Alexia and Chris. And she was like, asking questions about like why we voted off who we did and like she's like what did you do to become power player like she's really in it and like was getting like deep into it so she's probably like a bigger threat too just so that you all know you don't have to do this for me but for the three of you um i i need some friends so i'll i got your back if any of you are up to vote to be into the voice i got your back i won't vote for it any of you. okay Not- I mean, I'm not much help in the void right now, but if I ever get out, that happens. Yeah, I'm down to form the lines now. It seemed like there was a little bit of talk about a pack in the works between the four of us. Uh, I don't know if they will go through with it, but I think I will as much as I can. It, it, it was nice being, being so out, like being in the void, but the benefits of, of being in the void, like I, I got to learn a lot. And um, although I'm on the outside, like tonight made me feel like I was still in the game. So it it was nice. It definitely felt like the game started um, with that conversation. Hello. 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 How are y'all? I'm good, how are y'all? What's going on? Ella, I want to know the same thing. What is going on? I don't know what's going on. I have no (laughs) idea. (laughs) Okay, so Armani, is that your name? Yes. Okay, I'm Hannah. Hey, Hannah, it's nice to meet you. You too. Like, there's so many people. Y'all, this game is getting kind of crazy. What do you mean? First of all, I thought Karashikia would be like, I thought she would come back tonight. I like thought for some reason that like it would be me, Ella, and Karashikia again. Who? I don't know who that is either. Okay, but Hannah, were you a power player? No, I haven't been like a power player yet. Wait, where have you been? Like, what What group were you in so, last time? Yeah. the, like, first night that there was power players, I was in the non-threat group. Okay, so, <laughs> I went to the Void today, and I think Kirachikia went to the potential power players, was that last night? Wait, so how did you get sent to the Void? I think that was, was today. Was it today? Okay, I yeah. wasn't technically in the void. I was in the safe group, I, but I was invited to the void to speak to the people that were in the void. Oh, who, did you ever find out who wanted so to go? So Shelby in? and Alex are in the void. Yeah, I heard about that because Manu told me because he was oh. in the power players. And last night I was on a call with him. He was telling us like about like their discussions and everything. Ella, don't you? What are they discussing? That like Manu literally did not talk, but like kind of yes. Out, He's been like voting people out. 
Yeah, yes. that's what he told us last night. He was, yeah, this is basically what he told us last night. He was like, um, in the past, he was like, I just ended up getting there. And then he was like, my strategy is to just vote everyone terribly. Like, he just gave everyone, like, really, really low scores so that his score would end up being higher because he's giving everyone low scores. That was basically what he told us. So, like, that night that you and me were with him, he gave us, like, once. Like, he's just been giving everyone once. And, like, the like, basically slow ass words so that like he is like raised up and everyone else is like put down is me i've been giving why i was trying to figure out how the heck did he become a power player and he doesn't talk exactly exactly and, and that's that what i was wondering too it's the quiet ones right. you guys you know, you know we were all like this is his strategy <gasps> this has to be his strategy yeah i was just like I'm shocked. Dude, I was like wondering. I was like, how do I keep getting in like the low groups? Like it's I've always funny. been in like the low groups, and I'm like, I've been talking to people. I've been social, like you know, like I've been like going out of my way to try and like be conversation starter and stuff. Yeah. And I was like, how do I keep getting these low scores? And like apparently that's like what he's been doing. Cool. So I don't know about anyone else, but yeah. He needs to go. Like he's sneaky. Yeah. We have to get him out of here. Yeah. It's crazy. It's because literally was not talking like he would watch people talk like he was not talking he told me that he started taking notes of people too no like what yeah because yesterday he was like yeah i decided to start taking notes on people girl <laughs> what? <laughs> yes what? Ella, like, when i went to the void it got spicy like we didn't have 45 minutes or whatever to talk but it got like real he even voted himself. Do you remember that day where we were just talking? Yeah. About like, our, like, we were awful talking decisions. about, like, yeah. Yeah. We made him. I was like, I think I should be. Oh yeah. God, and I was just like, oh, okay, like, I'm not going to fight the guy. Like, I was just like, okay, like, whatever. Like, you can have it. I know, you me know? too. But it's like, I guess, like, that's probably, because that's probably how we got into the leader group, too. Because, like, I was voted a leader, and I'm assuming you were, and he probably was, too. So he was probably like, oh, I'll do it. You feel me? Like, yeah. yeah. <gasps> He's sneaky. We have dirt. Isn't on it crazy? Way. Yeah, he literally does not talk. Like, I don't know. I was kind of, I thought he would be in the void initially. That's what I thought. But I was like, he would not call me. He wouldn't invite me. He's the only one who like, admitted to it. But I'm just like sitting here and I'm like, how do I keep getting like low scores? Like, I'm nice to everyone. Like, I talk to everyone. Like, Ellie, you've been in like conversations with me. Like, I, I feel like I have no reason yeah. to be like voted low. Yeah. And, like, I just wrote people like better than like I probably should. Yeah. So I'm like, oh, like, I don't know, they were nice. Like, I'll give them or whatever. I know. That's how yeah. I was. But when I got to the void, I was so surprised because, like, I talked to Shelby on the first night. Were you there? I, was it me, you, and Shelby, and then Chris on the first night? Mm -hmm. Shelby was so cool. And so when I got in the void, I was like, how the heck did you get in here? And I hadn't, I didn't meet Alex yet. So I was like, oh, nice to meet you. But I was shocked because like, man, he was a potential power player and Shelby's in the freaking void. Yeah. Like, I don't know. I don't know. I'm just kind of triggered by that. Cause he doesn't talk. I feel like the people in the void, like we were kind of talking and low key. Wait, what did we say? What did we say? We, uh, we everybody thinks man is a threat from what I see. But like, um, I don't know, like Ella, we were talking about, it was me, you and Kara Chikio, and we were talking about what she should say to the, the power players. Yeah, like she we asked like, her to ask, like, how did they yeah. get in here? Like, how did they get voted? Right, yeah. but apparently the people in the void were kind of talking about how she approached them in like a super like suspect way. It was super even, what way? In a super like sus way. It was just super really? like Yeah. Like we all thought Chris was kind of like a people pleaser almost. Like it's almost too good to be true, like how like easygoing he is. Yeah. But I remember that was actually now that I think about it, that was a keyword that Aaron used when she was talking about him. 
she was like he's really chill like super easy like i swear to god she said that too she was like he's yeah. just really chill really laid back like easy going like super nice and talkative like that she definitely right. just kind of using that word yeah oh i think gosh. what i'm gonna do is like because there is still like a, like especially chris like i've still never talked to him so like when if i do get the opportunity to like talk to him i'm gonna keep these things in mind mm -hmm. and i'm gonna try and like say something to see if like that's true right you know, like i'm gonna say something that like maybe he said like he didn't like or said that he you know what i mean like right. just to see like if he switches up anything so that I could be yeah. like, okay, he's literally just saying like what we want to hear or like what he knows he could say to make us like like him. Right. So we won't know him. I wasn't, ex I don't know, maybe being so quiet was suspicious, but I wasn't expecting him to like turn up on us like this. I cannot wait to see yeah. him. I can't wait to see him. But I, I can't even, oh, no. he kind of snapped. He is kind of snapping right now. <laughs> Like, he, he kind of snapped. I'm not even This the thing. No, this is just like a big plot twist almost. Because it's like we all kind of were just like, oh, yeah. Like, we kind of like doubted him in a way. Like, yeah. He's just like showing us like what's yeah. good. Like, he's like, actually, no. <laughs> it's crazy. Yeah. Like, it's about to get interesting from this point out. Like, it's about to get interesting. So, you heard it from me first. If we find anything out, we just tell each other whenever we're back yes. together. We have to form like a little alliance. Alliance, yes. yes. I'm like, like solemnly swearing as by me no too. Lines. Hand up. Oh, okay. For real. Solemnly swearing. Okay, but for real. Good. We okay, got goal this. is get me new out. That's our number one yes. target right now. <laughs> yes, I agree. Okay, Squad um, together. Yes, girl power. <laughs> yes, girl yes. power. Sasha, what group were you in last time? Like out of the three. Out of the three, I was in the power player group. Gotcha. Okay. Mm -hmm. <sighs> I took that drop. <laughs> My reaction being in the not safe group, I was kind of shocked just because I had been in the power player group and like more near the top groups every night. So I was just kind of shocked on what happened there. Like I drastically went from the top group to the bottom. And oh, oh it's Manu. Manu. Hey. I wasn't too worried about being sent to the void because the void is kind of like intriguing to me and I'm kind of drawn to the void and I want to know what it's like so I wouldn't be too upset if I get sent to the void. Huh. Interesting. Mm -hmm. We're all pretty close. Yeah. So these are based off of apparently if we're good decision makers and if we're memorable. Yes. Mm -hmm. So do we think it's like me, it's that I'm not memorable or not a good decision maker? Um, I feel like you're memorable. I mean, I don't know about our decision making skills, but I feel like you're memorable. Yeah. Someone is not grading truthfully because the grading for last night was how memorable are these people and i know that i am a memorable person last time okay. this is uh, like so for the last time okay great mm. i don't know because i don't know who they're gonna go for like i don't know if they'll go Cause like when we were talking, they wanted to save both you guys. So, like when we were power players, like I don't know if they'll go for it. Like you said, because you've already been in the posi same position, if they're gonna go for mm -hmm. that, if you've already been in the not safe group twice, or if they go, or if they'll go for us since we were power players at a point. Mm -hmm. So, do any of you want to go to the void? <laughs> I don't think anyone <laughs> wants to go. I don't. Think, I don't I know. I'm like looking at the email and it says like people who go to the void can come back in the game yeah. at some mm -hmm. point. I mean, where I am right now, like I wouldn't mind going to the void just because I already talked to them today and they just seem to be vibing in there. Mm hmm. Yeah, no, Alex and Shelby are. In the world. Yeah, they're super nice. Like, mm -hmm. so. Honestly, I feel like tonight we should almost like do like a random pick because honestly, I feel like any of us 
to be a target now that I know that you guys don't get to see scores. So I spoke up and I was like, oh, I feel targeted even though I don't really feel that targeted. I just low-key feel targeted. Yeah, I don't feel like anyone um, specific is trying to target you. Like, no one feels that way at all. I do. Yeah. <laughs> I, feel, oh. I feel like Chris is. Would. I feel like I could see that because yeah. I feel like just like from the vibes I got just from talking, I could see that. Yeah, like from our conversation, because he seemed like threatened that that I seemed to that I wanted to protect like Hannah and Aaron, and he was like, yeah, "Oh, he do you have like an alliance with them?" And mm. I didn't really. You just didn't want to send home people you knew. Yeah. Which is what we all did. We just sent home the people we didn't know. So he mm -hmm. thinks like I'm, I'm like super like strategic and have an alliance. I don't really have, I kind of do. I would say like, I would save you Manu probably too. Cause I could kind of feel that, that like they would come for you. I thought it was very easy to convince um, people to save me and like surprise me how easy that was. And I think we made a good call choosing me because I am a likely target, but I think Sasha is also a likely target. <laughs> That's a good GPA, Alexia. Thank you, look, thank you. I feel great about being a power play with Chris and Alexia. I'm kind of upset that I didn't get to tell Armani or Ella about the information. But... Oh. Oh. Oh no! I like That's those people. Wild is a hard decision. I knew right. this was about to be complicated. <laughs> Sasa, JJ, Aaron, Manu. Okay. Hey, we need to send two to the void. I know three, four of the, three of those people this time. Sasha's not safe group? That was surprising. I want to know what you guys think. I know JJ's. Um, I guess I have not met him yet. So I yeah. haven't met JJ. So both on JJ. I mean, to be honest, like the only two, if I had to pick the better two out of the three to eliminate, it would be unfortunately be be Aaron and then Manu. Yeah, I was gonna say Manu only because I feel like it's been really challenging to like converse conversate with him yeah and i know like originally like we picked him as like the leader but then like the next day i i don't i wasn't in a child till the next day but i was the next day and it was just like he just doesn't really say much and you never know where his, his head is at and it's just like yeah. hard to i don't know it's just i mean just, i agree i don't disagree <laughs> i'm not saying anything i was going manual too because i mainly because he does seem like he's not he seems like he's ready to play but he does seem distracted and what other better person to send to the void is somebody that we both uh picked as a power player and a potential power player in our group because even though he may have the skills he needs to work on his people skills so that'll give him time to like realize what's going on i guess maybe we could give him a chance let's yeah. give him in Let's keep him in. Let's 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 see how that works. Okay. Because I think I think um, based the other thing I was gonna say is even though I heard JJ was hilarious, for him to be at the bottom means that it's not memorable for him to be hilarious. I don't know. I I I only say Manu because I've had several interactions with him and they haven't really gone. They haven't progressed. Okay. So we're definitely for sure on Manu. Okay, Manu. Oh man, they were trying to get rid of you. 
I uh, I went along and tried to save you in in the in my few words that I was saying, but uh, it wasn't happening. But I mean, based on everybody wanting to save JJ, is definitely a vote. Oh my god! Because you guys want to save Aaron? I like JJ. Well, he missed yesterday. He was supposed to be in our group. Okay. Um. I just lost my train of thought. Okay, fine. I'm I'm down for JJ. Official. And, and he hit yeah. out, out of spite that he was supposed to be here yesterday and he wasn't. So yes, I will take my vengeance on the table. <laughs> 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 I will put my vengeance out there on the table. He was supposed to come and he bailed. I don't like bailers. I don't like flakers. Even though I'm the biggest flake. That I talked too much and I probably said too much. He was um, supposed to be here yesterday in the cop group? No, in my group. In Wait, the but you were group. in the group yesterday. Yeah, I was... I was, I was, I was, I was everywhere yesterday. <laughs> oh. oh, okay. Oh, wait a minute. Talking about questions and stuff. I, I, I'm a little fishy now, okay. Yeah, I'm, I am a state, hey, I'm all state. <laughs> yesterday, I was like, this is so random. All these like random questions. Where did this come from? Oh, but did you get to go to like? I'm trying to like wrap this in my head. Multiple... I've only been to one place today. Oh, <laughs> but yesterday you got to go to two places? Question mark. Question mark. <laughs> Check mark. Oh. I got and... to door the explore. It was fun. So you were in between the group two and the po potential power players. Yeah, I was rising star. I didn't know I was a rising star, but I'm a rising star. <laughs> All right. I just found out. She's taking notes. And we got an extra group that I'm not aware of. Oh my god. Rising stars. Who are you? And what are you doing? I can't hear nothing you guys are saying. You guys are lagging. Hold up. Is she in the chat? I did not know she went traveling yesterday. That's wild. That oh man. I mean I had my something was off. It was off. She she uh she definitely said some stuff, so <laughs> those questions were kinda of fishy. <laughs> Only with my guts. I I'm back. What's Hello? up? Hi. How safe group has a chance to say safe? Yay. Yay. How do we know who's in the not safe room? Oh wait, <laughs> never mind. Everybody else. Oh, so they saved one. <laughs> I wonder who they're gonna say. JJ. Menu. So JJ's the only one that's Okay, fine. so may you say, yay. But thank God they chose to save you because now you're gonna help me, help me by keeping me up here. As, as long as I got a scapegoat, I'm good. The game is heating up with targets, rivals, alliances, and now two players from season one are about to arrive to shake things up even more. Hi, I'm Elizabeth Gosalves, and I feel like season one, I didn't get to show off um, my true power and strategy. I was cut way too quick uh definitely the first one to go to the void which learning from that i definitely won't give as much information as i did in the first i won't trust too much no matter who <sighs> season two okay so my name is Delion rockamore and how i feel about season one wow season one was drama 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 but i loved it I loved every moment of it. I'm gonna let other people do the talking when it comes to disliking other people. And I'll stay quiet during those times. But I mean, we'll see how long that lasts because we all know how Delion is, so. I'm just gonna go for the goal, for the winning. <laughs> Okay, what you want, how you want to play this out. 
they're back. I think what's best about our game plan is just that we're not going to tell anyone from, we're from season one. Because, I mean, if we were, I don't think they'd really trust us. I swear, girl, you going to see me in a chat. I'm going to be like, hi, it's so lovely to meet you. <laughs> yeah. We got the new two players. Oh, my God. What a twist. I Does want anybody to else feel anxious right now? Or is it just me? <laughs> You know, they're gonna get along great and they're gonna have fun. It seemed like Chris might have been a little fake. Either me or Elizabeth have to win. Have to. Um, they already kind of seemed like they had an idea of what was going on. 